Going live. I'm live. Ooh. Hello. Merry Christmas. <laughs> Hi. I'm just going to share my live real quick and uh, get mom on her iPad. So just bear with me, guys, a little bit. Just if you're here, the magic word is... I don't know. What are we going to call it today, Mom? You choose. Jingle? Sure, why not? All right. We're going to do jingle as our word. So if you, S-H-A-R-E, hi, Deb Taylor. If you, S-H-A-R-E, tonight, the word of the day is jingle, jingle. Or just once. <laughs> you don't have to put it twice. <laughs> hi, Candace. All right. I'm sharing, sharing, sharing. Hold on. <laughs> All right, we're going to click the share button, which is that swoopy arrow. And then we're going to click on Facebook because that's where I want to go. It's going to create a big thing for me. And I'm going to say, party time. Party time. What am I supposed to write on? Let's jingle. I forgot to get my paper. That's what I need, just paper. Hold on. Oh. I'll give you this. Oh, I got it. I got it. I'm, I'm going to give you a notebook. Oh, okay. I was going to use it for notes, but there you go. It's time to jingle. It would help if I knew how to spell jingle. Just kidding. I'm a teacher. I should know. <laughs> Share to my story. Tag a friend. Uh, Pat Massey wanted to be tagged. So there we go. All right. So Pat, if you're seeing this, I hope you got it. I tagged you. Let's see if it works. All right, guys, so if you're going to share this video, you're either going, hi, everybody. If you share this video tonight, please make sure you comment the word jingle. Okay? Jingle is the word. J-I-N-G-L-E, jingle. <laughs> and I've got my feathers in today. Because <laughs> it's Christmas. <laughs> I got my dress on. Got all dressed up today. Look at this. Looking fancy. <laughs> or my version of fancy, I should say. So I see Pop Love. I believe that's Cor Caroline. Is that Caroline? I think that's Caroline. Deb Taylor, Candace Knipe, Adrian Watson, Candace Knipe, Christy Hubbard, Kathy Flowers, Cindy Price, Christy Hubbard again. Ma Ducks here. <laughs> Deb Taylor. Does not know how Colleen. To that's right. That's Deb right. Taylor doesn't know how to share on YouTube. Okay. Um, if you're on your computer, like your laptop kind of thing, it should be an arrow below the video line here. Okay. And it's an arrow that has like a little swoop and it says share. If you're on a phone, it could be on the side or it could be across the top here. Um, same thing if you're on an iPad. It could be somewhere around this screen. Okay? And then it'll um, it'll give you options to share, and you just share as you like. If you don't know how to do it and you're getting frustrated with it, don't worry about it. Just say jingle, and we'll throw you in there anyway. No worries. It's Christmas. Let's go. <laughs> yep, just say jingle, and you'll be all set to go. I'm just going to wait for more friends to come in. While we're waiting, guys, um, where did I put my extra bingo cards? That is the I question. Mom has them. Can I have them, please? Uh -huh. If you would like a bingo card and you did not claim one, please, 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 please. It is free to play, okay? So the following people have cards already. So it's only one per customer, okay? So Kathy, Candice, both Nipes, okay? Uh, Cindy Price, Serena McKell, Carla Weston. Clayton Thompson, Sharon Griffin Young, Teresa Romano, Lauren Martin, Deborah Taylor, and Adrian Watson. You guys all have cards. If anybody else would like a card, please say, I need one here, like raise a hand, and, and I will um, message it to you uh, on Facebook, Facebook Messenger. Christy Hubbard, you got it, babe. I need a sticky note. I have one. Why do you have all my stuff over there? Because you gave it to me. <laughs> so how's everybody doing? Christy, I'm get, getting you, honey. Hold on. I'm going to wait for mom to give me a sticky note. Because apparently she's got them over there. 
All right. Oh, she even put your name on. Look at that. All right. I'm going to take a picture of it and I'll send it your way. Hi, Deb. Jingle, jingle for Deb. Mom's getting all your jingles, guys. So I'm not ignoring you. I'm just trying to message everybody their cards. So we have Christy Hubbard. Christy Hubbard. Is everybody excited? I am so excited. I love Christmas. It's my favorite time of year, guys. And we're going to explain in everything that's going on. So don't worry. Don't get too um, overwhelmed because I know it's a lot. Oh, thanks. <laughs> yeah, I like to get a little fancy sometimes. Rock Def Diva. I don't recognize that handle. Who are you? Hello. <laughs> Athena, that's Clayton. Clayton's here. Hi, Clayton. The word of the day is jingle. We pick a new word every time, guys. All right, Miss Christy, that is in your messenger. So go grab it. Cindy Price loves your body butter. Ah, body butter. We're going to be doing that tonight, too. I have a whole list of what I have left. Ah, Teresa Romano. <gasps> That's Teresa Romano. Awesome. Lauren Martin, my best friend. <laughs> How you doing, Lauren? Yeah, we're looking super fancy tonight. I even brought my elf. That's my elf. That's Holly Twinkle. She is my kindness elf for school when I'm teaching. She came along today. <laughs> so be kind or she's going to give Santa a bad report. Okay. <laughs> These people are always kind. Yes, I know. You guys are always good. Sometimes we get a little questionable friends in here and out they go. <laughs> no, Teresa, no numbers yet. No, no numbers yet. No, Teresa, remember I call them out at random. So no worries. And you can claim a bingo card up until the first batch of numbers that have been called. Okay, guys? You had school today? Yeah, I was doing distance learning all week this week because they um, it was state mandated in Connecticut for West Haven. <sighs> I know, promises with the monkeys. Um, yeah, they sent us home for Thanksgiving break, and then they said, just take the rest of the, the, uh, the rest of the week off. So we did. We took the Friday. And then they said the following week, we're all going to do distance learning. So I was like, oh, okay. So mandated distance learning. That's fine. I'll work from home. So I worked from home. I had my elf behind me. I was doing my lesson plans, getting a groove. And it was a fun week. It was really fun. <laughs> What's that? No chairs will be thrown tonight. Yeah, don't throw my chairs. All right, guys. Well, we're seven minutes in. I think everybody else has a, everybody's got their cards. We're good. All right. So here's my intro. My name is Ducky Stevenson or Samantha Stevenson. Ducky is my nickname. I am the owner and operator of Ducky Soapy Creations. That's what you're going to be seeing tonight. Welcome if you're new. If you've been with us before, you know, guys, that the drill is. Um, everything here is all handmade by me. There is no other manufacturer in this space but me. All made by me, handmade, organic. All of these products are great for my sensitive skin and my friend's sensitive skin when I send them products for them to try. I can't guarantee that products will work for you, but they have worked for me, and that's why you'll be seeing them tonight. If you don't see it tonight, I either didn't like it, um, it didn't come out right, or I got bored and I changed it, and it's just... It's wacky here. It's crazy. We're a fun group here, and I think we're going to have a lot of fun tonight. Um, tonight's exclusive things that are going on. As always, we have the deal of the day when we go live. Um, it's been a big thing that we've been doing lately. Uh, for, so for deal of the day for lips, uh, lip balms is if you buy four lip balms, I'm going to give you another one. So the fifth one will be free. Okay. Um, also, if you purchase 10 bars of soap tonight, so that could be any kind of bar of soap. So say you want uh, three of these, two of those. If it adds up to 10, you get $5 off your order tonight. How cool is that? That also goes for cupcakes, but you cannot mix bars with cupcakes. And you'll see what I mean in a minute. Um, behind me, there is a game going on. As always, we do mystery Lucky Duck bags. Lucky Duck bags are $5 each. These are purchased products, okay, guys? Um, we've had that problem in the past where people have claimed bags and then said, oh, no, I didn't know it was a purchase. I thought you were just giving them away. They're a purchase. They're $5 each, but I pay the tax on them, so it's like my little gift to you. They're tax-free, okay, those bags. There are 20 
four of them tonight, okay? 24. Inside those bags, there are all different kinds of products that you normally wouldn't pick for yourself, but hey, you might want to, you know, you're going to try. It's a chance for you to try something that you normally wouldn't pick for yourself. And inside two of those bags, okay, I usually only do one, but inside two of them are lucky ducks. You can't call them. You cannot yet. call numbers yet. Please don't call numbers. I will not count them until I say that it is open and it's not open yet. Um, inside those bags, there are two lucky ducks. Now, a lucky duck gets you five dollars off your order as well as whatever is on a written on a ticket or actually in the bag itself it's a free item okay but you do have to pay for the bag all right if you are a lucky duck winner that's awesome look at that you guys win um not everybody's going to win a lucky duck because there's only two of them but it's a chance right so um the numbers are from one to 24 okay and it's the first ones that pop up on my screen so Adrian's 12 does not count because I have not opened it yet. Um, so 1 to 24, if the number has been claimed already, we are going to read through what is left. And as soon as all of the bags have been chosen or boxes, because some of those are boxes, um, once the bags and the boxes have been chosen, then we will start opening them up. But I'm going to continue on with the live, you know. Just until they're picked. But if they're filled up right away, we're going to open them up right away. I see that we're at 15 friends. If we get to 20 friends tonight, I will be doing a free giveaway, a mystery giveaway. So we need five more friends in here. Um, everybody is welcome to come and join. You can invite anybody you'd like. Um, more the merrier. And the bags are now open. But they're going to do shipping first. Nope. Nope. Okay. Bags are open. Okay. Well, thank God I found these. Well, and while they're picking bags, I'm going to let you do that. And if somebody duplicates, then tell me. Okay. <laughs> All right. While you guys are picking bag numbers, I'm going to talk about shipping. Shipping is a topic that we got to talk about. You want your products? Got to ship it. Unless, of course, you live local to me. Okay. Shipping is done in flat rate USPS shipping boxes. Okay. Um, with that being said, I don't take any profit whatsoever. I'm sorry, I'm putting on my shoes because my toes are cold. <laughs> I don't take any profit whatsoever from shipping at all, okay? I only charge what the post office charges me to ship it. I try and keep the cost low by putting your items in a smaller box, in a small box, but so that your items still don't get damaged at the same time, okay? I fit, uh, put it in the appropriate box so that it gets to you safely. Um, shipping, with the shipping, okay, um, you'll see it on your invoice as a flat rate shipping. There's no tax on shipping, okay, guys? It is what it is. Shipping, get this thing in front of my face, sorry. Um, so flat rate USPS boxes. This is what they look like, okay? So if you have a smaller order with less bulky items, you're going to get an $8.30 mailer. Now, this is roughly the size of a half a sheet of paper. It's not that thick, okay, guys? So when you get these, it's probably one or two items. Lynn Dadio. <laughs> Hi, Lynn. Jingle. The word is jingle, Miss Lynn. And Lynn, if you want a bingo card, please let me know and I will send you one. And Deborah Taylor, you cannot have number 16. Deb Taylor, you cannot have 16, Mom said. Because Cindy Price got it first. Okay. Teresa Romano, jingle. All right. So that's the $8.30 mailer. Now, I can bump these out and bend them to fit uh, bigger items. But I can't bend them too much because otherwise the post office gets mad at me and they won't ship your product. So, all right, so that's the $8.30 mailer. The next one is the medium mailer at $15.05. This is a general, typical order would fit in one of these, okay? It is very big, all right? It holds a lot, okay? So this is the $15 mailer. Um, hold it down so you guys can see. So most orders go out in one of these, all right? And if you're really enthusiastic with your ordering tonight, you get one of these guys. Now, this is a very rare occurrence, but sometimes it's necessary, especially with the gift sets that I have tonight. 
They are bulkier and they don't fit in the smaller ones, okay? This is the $21.10 mailer. Again, I take no profit from shipping. This is just what the post office is currently charging me to ship your items. All right, so again, I try and get it into the smaller boxes to save you guys a little bit of money, but at the end of the day, I have to ship it in what is going to fit the items that you chose. All right, so that's what shipping is going on with. All right. Teresa wants to know, are the numbers for the mystery bags? They're for your yeah. $5 bags. They are for the $5 lucky duck bags behind me. They are numbers 1 through 24. However, 12, 4, 14, 16, Here. 23, 20, and 13, 19, and 10 are spoken for. Because I only have one of each number. Oh, and before I forget, that game you guys were playing, that mystery uh, bonus round we played tonight, I'll take 10. You know, you, you, yeah, you have 10. You got it, Teresa. You got it for 10, right? Yeah. Yeah, mom's got you. I have no idea where the lucky ducks are, guys, because I filled that last week and my brain is just like, I have no gone. Idea. <laughs> and mom wasn't here, so you can't even bribe her to tell you where they are. <sighs> All right, we're good. So everybody's good on shipping. Everybody's good on what the products are that we're going to be talking about tonight. Okay. Everybody jingled. Everybody jingled. So we're good. Okay. Um. Oh, we went down to 13. Got to get to 20 to get that special prize here. All right. So bingo prizes are exclusive bars that I make specifically for the live. Okay. You won't see them anywhere else unless, of course, I think they're absolutely too cute. and I make them for next year. <laughs> Kelsey Massey. Is that Pat Massey? Pat, did you find me? Lynn Dadio, you can have five. Yeah, Lynn Dadio, you can have five. I have this little piece of hair that's in front of my face. <gasps> Yay, Pat, you found me. <laughs> yep, Pat, numbers are still available for the Lucky Duck bags. Remember, there's two Lucky Ducks in there. Okay. And the word, right. is, word is jingle. And the word is jingle. Yes. If you share, if, it, if you want to share this somewhere, the word is jingle. Okay. So let's see. All right. So the bonus round today was what is, um, oh goodness. What was the question? I have the answer, but I just don't remember what the question was. Ah, it's been my life today, guys. I swear. All right. So let's see. Dougie sub creations, events. The Jingle Bubble Party discussion tab. All right. So the question was, besides lights, name something found on the Christmas tree. Okay. There was a lot of great answers. You guys got a little creative towards the end. The answer was, okay, let me show you. I'll show you on my phone. Because I write these all down. I take a picture of them, post them. The answer, you guys see that, was Pickle. It was the first one there. There was also the option of ornaments, tree topper, tinsel, uh, ribbon, and what was the last one? Garland. But the answer I was looking for was pickle. And the two people, there was two people that got it right. <laughs> you got your order today, Dawn? Awesome. Dawn, today, tonight's word is jingle if you share, okay? The two people that got that right who earned, each of them earned, 20 entries into the share drawing tonight on top of whatever they earned during the week was Lauren Martin and Teresa Romano. The two of you got 20, 20 entries. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I thought the only person that was going to get it right was Lauren. Cause Lauren knows uh, my family's traditions about pickles on, on the tree and uh, well, a pickle, I should say one pickle. Um, but I didn't know anybody else knew about pickles on a tree. You always did the pickle on the tree at grandma's house, T Teresa. That's awesome. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So Sharon Young is here. Her <gasps> phone was being wonky. Hi, Sharon. She wants to know what she missed. Sharon, you, um, I talked about shipping. Okay. So shipping again, is flat rate mailers. Um, the smallest box is $8 and 30 cents. That's the small little envelope one. Um, then there's the $15 mailer. Okay. $15, five cent mailer. 
And then there's the 21 <laughs> mailer, which is gigantic, but I'm sure nobody will need one of those today. Um, so that was the shipping. That's all we talked about was shipping and who won. Oh, and the mystery Lucky Duck bags behind me. Two of them have $5 off your shipping inside as well as a free item. They are $5 each. I pay the tax on it, so no worries there. And if you'd like a number, just call them out. Oh, what numbers are available? I'll okay, hold on. No, you're not going to tell me. You're going to hand me the paper. That's what I mean. Okay, if you hand me the paper, then they can hear me. Yeah. All right, here's what's left. One, two, three, seven, eight, nine, eleven. 15, 17, 18, 21, 22, 24. Hi, Carla. No, you did not miss any bingo numbers yet, hon. We're still doing Lucky Duck bags. If anybody wants to write those in the comments, I do award helpers. Ducky helpers get a little bit of loving at the end of the live if you're still here. You get put into a secret drawing. <laughs> Can't figure out where to share. Don't worry about it, Don. We'll throw you in anyway. No worries. Just say jingle. <laughs> it's been tough. It, I know. Not everybody's sure what's going on and what we're doing. If anybody needs a bingo card, please let me know. This is your last opportunity to get one, okay? Okay. Adrian, you cannot have one and two. Carla, uh, these bags behind me are $5 each. I pay the tax. So those are tax-free bags, okay? Wow, she's got a lot on here. No, no, no. Adrian's no, she's listing. She's oh, helping you. Excuse me. Oh my god. I'm sorry, Sam. <sighs> Give me a break. Being a helper is hurtful to your wallet sometimes. Mom yeah, doesn't well, know what you're she, doing. She claimed something. <laughs> she said All right, never mind. So one, two, three, seven, eight, nine, eleven, fifteen, seventeen, eighteen, twenty-one, twenty-four are all still available. Okay? I don't need the paper. Adrian wrote it down. Yeah, well, one and two are not available. Oh, one and two are not available anymore. They're gone. Neither seven. And so a seven that's why I and eleven. It again oh, Clayton okay. Oh, that's right. Clayton took a few. Yeah. Sorry. Thank you, Clayton. All right. So the available numbers left are three, eight, nine, fifteen, seventeen, eighteen. 21, 22, 24. Okay. So Clayton took some and Adrian, we're throwing you in the drawing for the, the separate drawing for the helper. Thank you. So these are the ones that are left. Okay. Bingo. Dad, stop. Do you guys hear him? He's saying bingo. I haven't even called the number yet. I won. Thank Your you, Dad. always wins. <laughs> There's Dad. <laughs> That's Papa Duck. He's getting some chips. <laughs> Thank you for helping everyone. So that's Deb Taylor, Adrian Watson, Colleen, Cindy Price. All right. Thank you for helping. I usually take about the first three or four people to help. Thank you. Thank you. All right. So let's get into it, shall we? <laughs> Teresa Romano says, hi, Dad. Hi. <laughs> Carla Weston, you want number three and number 18? You got it. Mom, you got her? No, you've got my paper. Oh, it's right there. I didn't Jeez. go far with it. All right, guys. And before we get started, um, I'm going to show you something. Hold on. This is the share drawing bag for tonight's winner, okay? It's all puffed up, okay? It's a backpack. <laughs> It's a snowman backpack. I added a bow and inside are all the goodies. Now there's tissue in there to puff them up a little bit. It's not all, <laughs> it's not that big, um, but it's a little backpack for the holidays. I added the bow on top so you can take it off if you don't like the bow, but this is our share drawing win tonight. It is worth $25 tonight. And if anybody wants any of these snowman backpacks, I do have extras if anybody wants one. <clears throat> the backpacks are $2 each, okay? I need my water. All right, Cindy, are you claiming those? 
or are you helping? No, I think she's helping, honey. All right, I think that's a help, yeah. Sharon Young, seven. Nope, Sharon Young can't have seven. Sharon, you can't have seven. Pick another one. My husband is the it wizard. IT, never set IT, oh, help. sorry. IT wizard never set up our printer, so I had to write my bingo card down on a napkin. That works. Yep, that's fine. Cindy's helping. Okay. I was just checking. Just checking because that was a lot of numbers, so. Not a problem. Yeah, like I said, you guys can write it down on a paper. You can just, you know, take a picture with your phone and play on your phone. It's up to you. You want a snowman backpack, Candace? Okay. If anybody wants a snowman backpack, please just say frosty. And then if you want multiples, tell me how many. So frosty and then however many you want. Let me see how many I have left first, though. And they're really durable, too, guys. These are not, like, any cheapy ones. They are they're pretty thick. All right, let's see how many we have. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. I have eleven. So who wanted one? Clayton wants two. Hold on, Candace hold on. wants one. All right, start at the top here. Candace. Candace wants one. Okay. Okay, so one for Candace. I'm just making a pile. You don't have to take yeah. it. Yeah. Adrian, they're $2. <clears throat> yeah, they're $2 each. Sorry. Choking on my water. One, two for Clayton. One for Christy. You smelled amazing at bowling. Oh, thank you. Yeah, any of the list, any of the scents listed on my Facebook page in that uh, photo gallery that has all the list of fragrances. Oh, you want to see one? Uh, yeah. Here, I'll show you the share drawing bag. This is what it looks like all puffed up. <laughs> so it's got white straps. I added the bow. The bow does not come <laughs> with the backpack. I added it. Okay, but that's what he looks like all puffed up. And he's a decent sized backpack. It's a standard size. It's drawstring. I need one more. Okay. Oops. They're two dollars each, and mom's destroying my thought. <laughs> You're putting things on top of things. All right. Oh. So Christy, I got you. At least Ann smelled amazing. Oh yeah. So Lindadio wants three. Let me see if I have three left. One, two. I need one for Christy because you didn't give me her. Two. I did. No, you did I not. I gave you I three. Have three. Oh, I have Candace one, Clayton two, Christy one. Okay, so here you go. This one's Christy. And Lynn wants three. I know. One, two, three. See, so this is what they look like unpuffed. <laughs> All right, so those are Lynn. One, two, three. All right, let's see how many I have left. I have one, two. I have three left if anybody wants one. You know she loves you, Mom. Oh, yeah, I know. I love my mama duck. Wouldn't be here without her. That's three. I folded okay. them together. Okay. So you should have a three, a two, a one. Okay. So, yep, yeah, so there's three left if anybody wants them. Otherwise, they'll be here for next year when we have our live again. <laughs> okay, I have three snowmen left. If anybody wants them, let me know. <laughs> All right, let's get down to business, shall we? What do you guys want to see first? We've got soaps, uh, lip balm, lip scrubs, bath fizzies, Christmas stuff, uh, body butter. We can get that out of the way if you want. <laughs> um, shower, steamer, shave, soaps, um, body scrubs, soap. You got it. All right. So soap it is. Let's go. <laughs> I didn't know you were going to two together. Yeah. I did. That's why. Oh, so you I have extra now. Which, how many extra do I have? One more, thank you. Let me get it in the box. <laughs> yeah, anytime you told me you needed multiples, I fold, uh, put them together and I folded them in half. Here's That's what I did. I didn't know. I found that out when I got over there. All right, so we have four snowmen left. Four. 
All right, we're starting with soap. Let's go. Yes, Adrian, we got you two snowmen. Mom? What? Two Adrian, right? Adrian wants to confirm that you got two. I don't think I have her hands. No, I don't have her hands. So let me have two. Two? All right. Adrian, thank you for checking because sometimes we mess up. Hold on. Don't make me get up too much tonight. This I'm not going to make you get up too much today. I know your leg hurts. Yeah. If it comes down to it, I'll come on the other side. You do this. <laughs> you like how I did that, guys? You see that? <laughs> All right, we're down to two snowmen, okay? Two left. All right, thank you for checking because whew, I don't want to miss anybody. I can't reply except as Kelsey. That's fine. She wants a bag. There's two left, Pat. Do you no, want? Does she want a five dollar bag? Do you want this bag, the five dollar tax free bag, or do you want the snowman bag? The snowman bag is two dollars each plus tax, okay? The Lucky Duck bags are $5, no tax. So you let me know. If you want a Lucky Duck bag, I'll give you the numbers again. If you want a snowman, just say Frosty, and then however many you like. I only have two left. No worries, Pat. Yes, you can comment as Kelsey. I know who you are. Clayton does the same thing. He's logged in as his wife, Athena. So I know worries. I got it. And Rock Def Diva. I mean, that's Teresa Romano. <laughs> All right. Pop so, Love is Colleen. And Pop Love is Colleen. <laughs> so no worries. All right. So while you guys are doing that, I am going to pull the soaps. And we'll get the soap show going. All right. Cindy, you helping again or are you claiming? I know you're helping. Thank you, love. All right, so we want soap. Moving on my phone out of the way. All right. Okay. Lucky Duck bags are mystery bags that you buy for $5 each. There's no tax. There are items inside. Um, some of them have multiple. Some of them have only one item. Two of those bags or boxes, because some of those are boxes back there, um, have what is known as a Lucky Duck prize inside. That Lucky Duck gives you a free little toy duck and five dollars off your shipping as well as a free item that's inside already or it's on a piece of paper written down um if you'd like them comment the numbers that are available Cindy price has put them up on the screen mom just want you to confirm that those are still available so let's see these are the ones that are available it is number eight number nine Number 24, number 22, 21, 17, and 15. These are the numbers that are available. Once this all gets um, filled up, then we will start to open those. All right, so these are the numbers that are available. Please comment the number you would like. And, of course, we don't have a share drawing winner yet, but we will by the end of the night. Okay? All right, Pat, so that's what these are. Okay? They're $5 each. All right, so let's go. First one I'm going to show you guys tonight is called Galaxy. Galaxy is our... Hi, Kay. Lisa Coffee. Coffee, coffee. Hey, coffee. How's that, how's that ride going? Or are you there already? I know you're traveling today. Guys, can we give Lisa some hearts, please? Give her some hearts in the comments. Thinking of her today and her family. All right, guys, so we have Galaxy Bar. This is my one and only soap bar that glows in the dark. It is super cool, guys. It is made with clear vegetable soap. It also is swirled. You see that swirl in there? It is swirled with coconut oil soap. Yeah. It is swirled with coconut oil soap, and it is scented with what is called Midsummer Night's Dream fragrance oil. That fragrance oil is my own custom blend of lavender, um, a little bit of, where is it? I used to know it by heart and I don't know it right now. Out of practice. It's a bit of, let's see, Midsummer Night Dream. A mix of, a mix of lavender, mahogany, patchouli, splash of lavender. There we go. <laughs> so that's this one here. It smells amazing, guys. And do you see that little bit of glitter in there? That is all biodegradable and it goes right down the drain. Oh, I see people commenting. Don Welch. 
eight fifteen twenty four. You got, got it. it. I got Pat Massey too. And Pat Massey nine and twenty one. You got it, love. Is Pat gonna jingle? Pat, are you jingling tonight? <laughs> Mom, just put her in. I will. <laughs> She's had a hard enough time getting here. <laughs> Don't worry, Pat. I got you. I got you. And Pat wants 17. And Pat wants 17. Okay. So numbers available are, what are the numbers, Cindy? Cindy's been helping me out today. Let's see if she's right. Mama Duck has, oh, Cindy, you missed. <laughs> you missed one. The only bag left is number 22. Who wants it? <laughs> 22 is the only bag remaining. If somebody takes it, then we can open them. Okay, 22 is the only one left. Can we put Christy Hubbard and Cindy Price yeah, honey. in for helping? Because yep, they've been doing okay. a lot of helping. And Adrian, too. Yep. Who else has been helping? Deborah Taylor. Christy Hubbard. Mom's putting you in. She's making a list. She's going to put your names on tickets and throw you in for the helper drawing. Lisa, you want 22? You got it. That's it. Bags are gone. We will open them after I'm done showing this. Uh, is, that, is that Tabby? <gasps> Tabby! Tabby Cat. What's the share word? Jingle. J-I-N-G-L-E. Jingle. Because my ears jingle. <laughs> Got my feathers in today too. <laughs> I tried the um, the fabric softener sheet on them, and they got way less staticky, so we're good. Thank you for that tip. All right, so this is Galaxy. It's going to be number twenty six if you'd like it. It is our standard size bar. It is three inches across, two inches wide, and one inch thick cut. There, this one is five dollars and seventy five cents each plus tax. I only have a few of these left, so please, if you'd like them, comment that number down below. Number 26, Amy Mitchell. Amy, you missed the bags. I'm sorry. They're all gone. <laughs> we have this problem, baby, every time. I'm sorry. Amy. Oh, Amy, uh, since you're here and people who just popped on, I have two backpacks left. Does anybody want one? Show what they are, Phil. This is what they look like when they're flat. They're drawstring. They got frosty on them. And they're $2 each plus tax. One of them is going to be the share drawing win tonight. It looks like this when it's all puffed up. I added a bow. So you don't get a bow with the bag, but I added the bow on the share drawing bag. If anybody would like them, I have two left. And you just say frosty if you'd like one. I have two left. And they're $2 each. Should have bought more. <laughs> oh, sorry, Amy. She thought it was at 8 o'clock. No, seven, always seven. That's okay. I'm happy you're here. I'm happy you made it. Okay, so if anybody wants them, I have two left. That's all you missed, Amy, was the bags and Frosty. All right, get open those bags now. We only got to show one bar of soap. That's okay. We'll get back to it. So we'll do soap right after we do the, ba uh, the bags and boxes, okay? Uh, Pat Massey, Jingle, we got you, Better. babe. I got you, babe. All right, Mom, start with number one. Let it be number one. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm not there. <laughs> Where'd I put it? Sorry, honey. Okay, Clayton. Clayton? What else is Clayton have? He has number two. Oh, look, Clayton, you got Santa. I know him. <laughs> he number has one. Number seven. He has one, two. Got some holly. Okay, number seven. Yeah. Uh, ooh, we got a nutcracker. 11. <laughs> Number 11. Ooh, you got a snowman. And I think that be it. Yep. Okay, that's Clayton. Tabby for Jingle. Thank you, Tab. Tabby. All right, Mr. Clayton, here we go. Ignore my mess that I got going on here, guys. Sorry. Uh, my friends who just showed up, if you would like a bingo card, please let me know. Okay? They are still available because I haven't pulled any numbers yet. All right. Because that's my rule. As soon as I start pulling those bingo numbers, can't claim one. All right. So we got 11, 7, 2, and 1. These bat boxes are so much fun, you guys. 
I had so much fun putting them together. All right. What? Yes, please. Okay, Amy, I'll send you one. The first box. Clayton, you got cherry pie soap. This will be available as well tonight. Is it goat's milk soap? And it smells like cherries and almonds. So that's the first one. Okay, that one's Clayton. Bam. Number two. Ooh. Holiday cheer soap. This is also available tonight. It is scented with raspberry cranberry oranges, and it's striped like a peppermint. And it also has a little bit of bling on top, but you can't really see it in this picture. <laughs> so that's number two. Number seven. Kind of tricky to open, though, because his head is stuck. <laughs> telling you guys these boxes were something else i got them for free from a company they said here try them you might like them i think they're super sinking cute um, all right so well, excuse me what? what was amy yes please and you about amy you need a bingo card right i'm gonna need more of these then yep because there's a bunch of people that need cards go ahead okay. keep, keep doing clayton look, all right look. so clayton here you go this is inside the nutcracker Blue Skies Soap Bar. It is scented with Suit and Tie fragrance oil. Suit and Tie is a mix of bergamot, gold, amber, and spice. I know that one because it's awesome. They're all awesome, but this is one of my favorites. <laughs> For, like, the guy scents. Okay? So that's that one. Got to be careful with these because I don't want them to rip. Okay. You just squish down the head and you slip the rest of it over the top. Very easy to close. Yes, please, for bingo. Okay, we'll get you guys cards. Hold on, Mom's got to go get more papers. All right, because she's writing name tags so that I can just stick them to the card, take a picture, and send it to you via Facebook Messenger. Are you done with Clayton? Not yet. Okay, He's got one more box. Okay. Clayton, you have inside Frosty, you have Raspberry Whimsy Soap, and it has that beautiful glitter top and that lovely braided inside. This is Black Raspberry Vanilla. Congratulations, and those are your claims, Clayton. What a good picks. You got all soap there, my friend. Nice. I love these soaps. All right, and you get these cool boxes and a bag. All right, let me have this. All right so this is Clayton. One. Ooh, yeah, well, it's all soap. <laughs> Two, three. He actually got some really good deals there. All right. Those cards one more. All right, we're going to do cards while mom's up. All right. And then we'll do some next person's number. All right, so we need one, two. I need one for Tabby. I know. I got to get you more. I'm in the middle of trying to do Yeah, no worries. You're welcome, Clayton. And they're just random guys. I just pull them out of the bag. I shuffle them, and I just pick them out at random. So it's, it's all random. All right, Lisa, here comes yours to Facebook Messenger. You can either print it out, have it out on your phone, but you need to keep track of it. I don't keep track of bingos. Only mom does that, and I can't see it because it's behind the camera. <laughs> and I won't tell you when you have it. And she won't tell me. <laughs> oh, no, Rosalie. It won't let you in? All right, Rose, I'm going to send you the link. Hold on. Just let me send Lisa and all, their, all, all the people their things. Hold on. All right, Rosalie says she can't get in. I want Lisa coffee. Oh, goodness, guys. It's always like this the first hour of the show. So please stay with me. Don't go anywhere, okay? I'm not ignoring anybody. I'm just getting everybody squared away so over all the games because I like to play a lot of games during my lives. Lisa, is yours is in your inbox. Amy Mitchell, you're next. And then Miss Tabby, once mom writes the ticket. Amy, Lisa. Mitchell. Did I, I give you Lisa? You gave me Lisa and Amy. Okay, and then I got Dawn and Tabby. Okay, I need one for Dawn. Okay. Tabby. All right, Amy, you yours is in your inbox. You got your package today, Pat. Yeah, Miss Wendy got hers too. She sent me an email. I was like, whoo, I was about to go all out on that postal worker today. Oh, my God. I was like... It better have gotten there. And they're like, yes, yes, it got there today. I was like, are you sure? And they were like, yeah. And then I got home and I got the email from Wendy. I was like, yes, it got there. 
I was about to start screaming. I sent it like eight days ago. It's supposed to be two day shipping. They what the heck? Smelling it. Yeah, they were probably smelling it. Mm -hmm. I'm going, ooh, it smells so good. <laughs> All right, Miss Dawn coming at you. Hold on. Dawn Welch. There's your card in your inbox for Messenger. Tabby, here we go, babe. Yeah, you do. <laughs> Ooh, I'm telling you guys. And with shipping, okay, that is a big thing to know, all right? I cannot ship past the 10th of December. So your invoices will be going out immediately, okay? And tomorrow. Tomorrow. Like tomorrow, they're all going out at once, okay? Because <laughs> I have a little surprise coming in your box <laughs> for the first 10 friends who pay their invoice early. Okay, and I, that's why I'm going to send them all out at once tomorrow. Okay, by the end of the day tomorrow, they will all be out at once. Okay, give everybody equal opportunity. Um, who am I doing? Tabby. Tabby, are we friends? On, oh, shit, yeah, it's under a different name. There it is. Okay, I got you. I got you. I'm sorry, I'm going to have what I had. No, I know. She, um, her, it's just like, you know, the, uh, Rock Def Diva and yeah. just a different name. All right. So there's Tabby. Um, the last day for me to ship is December 10th. Okay. I cannot ship after that and guarantee that it'll get there by Christmas. Well, the post office said you can't. Right. The post office said you have to ship by the 10th in order to guarantee it gets there for, before Christmas. If I ship after the 10th, like the 11th or something, I cannot guarantee that it will get there by Christmas. Okay. All right, so that's the only thing. So that's why we're also giving an extra incentive. If you pay your invoice early, there are 10 friends who are going to get a special surprise from me as like a Christmas gift. Okay? Been working hard. <laughs> I went mental at the Nods and Tuck post office because I wasn't getting any mail packages, bill, but junk mail, the paper, anything. Wow. Oh, my God, the bow came out and the New York... City accent could oh be heard God. from the street. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you get him. Get him. <laughs> I texted Wendy as soon as I got home from work, opened and smelled the malawa. What do you think, Dawn, of the green tea? I think you got green tea too. Let me know. All right. Next number. Okay, you have two backpacks left, right? I have I two want to make sure I'm good. Yeah, I only have okay. two backpacks left. Okay. You guys like my dress? My birthday dress from okay. when I turned 20. Number three. Ready? Yeah. Carla Weston. Number three. Snowman. And I believe that's the... Oh, oh nope. She's got 18. 18. And that's it. 18. Okay. So three and 18. All right. I love my dress. Oh, you love it? I'm experimenting with it in soap right now. I'm can't promise anything, but I am working on something. <laughs> Thank you, Candace. I'm like maybe five feet, but the scariest thing in pigtails <laughs> you ever made. Oh, <laughs> Thank you, Cindy. All right, we're going to go with this one first because it's easier to open. Number 18. <laughs> Here we go. Ooh, it's kind of tall. I wonder what it is. Oh, it's a cupcake. I also have these available tonight for purchase, too. It's a little piece of paper that just fell out of the bag, guys. <laughs> Another big, don't worry. All right, it is snowflake cupcake. It is scented with cool musk. This is an older design. I don't make this one anymore. Well, clearly I make it, but I don't. This is an older one. I don't make it this style anymore. So there we go. Cool musk. It's got a clear base, and it is made with goat's milk yep. for the top portion here and this little piece up here as well. And it's, you can use it just like a regular bar of soap. The top here is fluffy whip soap. and it's, Oh, yeah, I did my nails today. Yep. This is called, um, what was it? Ocean Green, I believe, but it came out more blue. I don't know. It's that um, acrylic dip. It goes on one color, and then as soon as you put the activator on it, it turns a different color. <laughs> I don't know. It matches my dress. I like it. <laughs> All right. Snowman. If I can get the 
<laughs> get the face off. Oh, that's why, because I taped it to the face. Oh, I'm stupid. <laughs> there has not been one scent out there that I've gotten that I don't like. Well, that's good. Good thing you say it's scented and soap, because knowing me, if I just saw that, I would eat it. Yeah. <laughs> My brother's friends, they know when they're when they used to come over, they knew that if um you guys see what's poking out. Uh <laughs> they know that when they come over, they get free reign of any goodies that are on the counter. I had a set of those sitting out on the counter drying before I wrapped them in like, you know, a nice cleaned out space and everything. One of them grabbed it off the table and started like to go like this, the motion to eat it. And I was like, no, don't do that. It's so but he goes. What? And I was like, yeah, it's soap. It goes, I thought he was going to go to the hospital, guys. Oh, my gosh. <gasps> Collect. Oh, uh, do you see? Do you I see? Got you got the lucky book. <laughs> you, got, you found one. And inside is a lip balm called Piece of Cake. Honey, that's Carla, not Clayton. What? It's Carla Weston. This is Clayton's box. You did Clayton's boxes. This is Carla Weston. <gasps> this is Carla Weston. Oh, my gosh. I'm so sorry, Carla. <laughs> Carla, you found a lucky duck. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I'm turning all red. So sorry. Yes, Carla Weston. Look, you found the lucky duck. That's $5 off your order and some lip balm. Alrighty. I'm going to put them all in the bag here, but you will get the box, okay? I'm just gonna, It's easier to put them in there because it, it was hard opening that box. It's too big. <laughs> it's too big. All right, so one person found one of the lucky ducks. Let's see if we can find the other one. Really? All right, let's sit down so you're done. Yep, Carla. It goes in her bin. Okay. Whew. We have another Sorry. C name. Please don't get confused. All right, another C name. Let's see. Christy so Hubbard. Rude. Christy Hubbard. Number All right, four. on YouTube, kick me out. What? Yeah. That's not cool, YouTube. We don't play like that. Be kind to of my people. Someone found a duck. Yeah. <laughs> That's Carla. Carla found a duck. I don't know if she's still here or not. Ooh, 18 friends. If we get two more, I do a giveaway. Okay, you want all the Christies? Yep, give me Christy. Number four. Hold on. Gotta get up. Ow. Number four. Number 14. Ho, 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 bag. 14. And that be it. Holly bag. She got two bags. Yep. All right, why am I dinging? Somebody claiming mm. something? Oh, I'm sorry, Rosalie. Tabby, I just sent you your card, honey. Sorry about that. I forgot to hit the button. Okay. Okay. Sorry, Rosalie. There's nothing I can do, hon, if it won't let you in. You have to have a Google account to chat. Four and 14. Here we go. Christy Hubba. Yeah, possible. if anybody wants to order anything, whew, message me on Facebook Messenger or Facebook itself or Instagram. If you can't get through, if you can't get through here, you just want to watch, but you don't want to sign in, that's fine. This might be a little bit of a response delay from my part because it's working, you know. Sorry. All right, so for number four. Is a bar of soap called Snowflake. The camera does not do that snowflake justice, especially in this wrapper. <laughs> but on top is snowflakes that are all cut by hand and pressed into the soap and sealed in with more soap. So they're not just sitting on top, guys. They are actually part of the bar. I will have this up for sale as well. It is a lilac goat's milk, bleh, lilac goat's milk scented soap. And it is three tall by two and a half across and one inch thick. It is a bigger bar and it is so awesome. This is one of the 2020 new designs. Okay. And then number 14. Oh, ooh, well, you didn't see that. I'll get you a new bag. <laughs> oh, look, you found another Christmas soap. Oh, Christmas tree. Ducky made a Christmas tree. It's inside a bar of soap. <laughs> And look, you have a little duck in the bottom. <laughs> and 
and the design goes right through to the other side. The only difference is that one side is a decorated tree and one is undecorated. Um, so this is scented with my own mix of Oh Christmas Tree scent, which is pine cinnamon sugar cookie. Literally my house at Christmas time when we had a real tree. Now we have fake tree at my house, but when I was a kid, always real tree. Yeah, before last year. Before last year. I'm still a kid though. <laughs> Let's be honest. <laughs> All right. So that's number 14 and number four. There we go. You ordered that already? Well, this one is there. All right. Next. Lindadio number five. Lindadio. I don't know why I'm talking like that. I'm not from the South at all. All right. Lindadio number five. Ooh, Lynn. You got an elf. <laughs> all right. Is that she just had five? Okay. I just want to make sure. Yeah. All right, Ms. Lynn. Here we go. Down. That you guys can see me opening it. I am being extremely fair. Not cheating. I have no reason to cheat. Trying to be very careful. Trying to be very careful so I don't break his little head off. Push down. Come on. Very careful. There we go. Whew. Yes, I know, Carla. I'm sorry. <laughs> I said the wrong name. All right, Ms. Lynn Dadio, Strawberry Lip Scrub. That is what you got there, my friend. Nice pick. That's a classic. Those will also be for sale tonight as well. Congratulations, Linda Dio. Yes, Carla, I got you. I'm sorry, my friend. I misspoke when I was calling out names. Buddy the Elf, what's your color? I don't know. I got Holly Twinkle. She's my elf. She's right there. She's my kindness elf for school. I call her my kindness elf because we can't have... Christmas elves at school, but we can have kindness elves. So she's my kindness elf. Right. Number six. Number six. Deborah we... Taylor. Deborah Taylor. Did she have any others? I'm looking. Okay. Number 20. You're welcome. Cindy Price, what are you talking about? How much or what, honey? I'm not sure what you're asking. Holly is not for sale. She is my elf. <laughs> you can't have her. 20. Number 20. 19. Hold on. 20. 19 and 6. 13. And 13. So, so we have the lip, the lip scrub she wants to know. Oh, the lip scrub. They are $5.50 each plus tax. Let me go over her name. Her, this is Deb Taylor. 6, 13, 19, 20. Yes? Yes. Okay. Just want to make sure I got them all. Yeah. Lip scrubs are $5.50 each plus tax. They come in strawberry and raspberry lemonade. But we'll get into those in just a little bit. We're going to do, continue doing boxes and bags right now. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Miss Deb Taylor, here we go. We're going to start with six and move our way down. Look, you've got an elf and a snowman. <laughs> and stripes and ho, ho, ho. <laughs> oh, these bags. They don't like me. They keep ripping. Try not to rip them. All right. Feel them too well. I know. One staple. That's it. And I'm <laughs> done. <laughs> All right. Oh, you got a Christmas tree bath fizzy. I still have these for sale as well. I'll be showing these later tonight, guys. It is scented with raspberries, cranberries, oranges, and it has little sprinkles inside that come popping out, and it turns your bath water a light green. All right, there's the first one. Yeah, that's not going to fit. I'm just going to lay it down. All right, now we got our, let's do this one. I'm going to do this one, because that one's hard to open. <laughs> What? Which number are you opening next? I'm opening 19. So I just want to check them off if you go so yep. I don't miss anybody. <gasps> oh, he's exploding. Look, there's there's lots of things in here. <laughs> you got a set of snowflake fizzies. These are all lilac scented, and each one does one lightly scented lilac bath. Congratulations. That's a set of bath fizzies. Come on, get your clothes. Er, all right, I'm just going to leave it like that. I will fix it later. <laughs> you He's having a bad day right now. All right, next one. Yeah, fun. Always having fun here at my house. All right, next one. Ho, ho, ho. It is cucumber melon cucumber swirly soap. It is a goat's milk soap bar, and it has pink curls running throughout it. That was in bag number 20. I do have some of these left for sale tonight, too. 
be showing that when we pick up back up with soap. All right, here's our elf. Number 13, very lucky, lucky in my family. 13, everything good happens on the 13th in this house. Parents got married on the 13th. 13 is our lucky number. All that jazz. Oh, no, you didn't. <laughs> Deb Taylor, look what you found. You found the other lucky duck. And it's a snowman inside of an elf. <laughs> and you got a piece of cake lip balm. Congratulations. That's $5 off your order and a duck and a lip balm. <laughs> All right, there's still really good prizes in there, guys, and I'm going to show them to whoever claimed them. So let's show the rest of those prizes, shall we? We Number shall. Eight. Let's go. Number eight. Number eight. Dawn Welch. Anything else for Dawn? Yeah. Anything. Okay, Dawn. Eight. 24. 24. 15. 15. Ooh, she had a nutcracker. I don't know what that means, but you just got a nutcracker. We good? All right. You're welcome, Deborah. All right, move you guys over. Here we go. First one. Be very gentle opening these box of bags because they're just, ugh. They're not thick. They're thin. All right, first one. Tropical Paradise Soap. This one is swirled with goat's milk and is lilac scented. Congratulations. I'm going to go a little faster, guys, so that we can get through some more stuff, okay? Whew. All right, next one. Ooh. Soap cupcake, oh, Christmas tree. I have these for sale, too. They are the same pine cinnamon sugar and um, cinnamon and sugar cookie. Bottom is a harder soap. The top is a whip soap. And then we have a mini soap on top. All the same scent. Congratulations. And last but not least. Yeah, those are very cute. Last but not least, we got our nutcracker here. What's inside? I'd like to know. Ooh. I'm going to slide it out. <laughs> it's a bar of soap with a turtle on it. This is called pink. Uh, this is called Turtle, Turtle Cove. It is pink sand scented, and it is a goat's milk soap bar. It's one of those irregular soap bars that we have here. And it's got a three-dimensional turtle on top, and it's a square. Congratulations. So, yeah, there you go. Two bags and a nutcracker. Look at, him. Look at his face. He's so cute. Next. Yep. I'm going to turn the fan on. I'm a little warm. Okay. Well, that's because you're in the dress. That's not because I'm in a dress. No. Looking this fabulous, you know. Mm. I look cool. You're hot, yeah. I'm hot stuff. Okay. All right. Turn the fan on. Let me know when you're ready. Yep, I'm ready. Oh, did you guys see my slippers? <laughs> They're right there. <laughs> Gotta complete the outfit. <laughs> <laughs> Pat Massey, number nine. Number nine. Number Pat. 17. Ooh, Pat got Santa. <laughs> she got 17. Nine. 17. Pat, you got both Santas. And 21. <laughs> and 21. And an elf. Because you can't have two Santas with no elf. <laughs> that's, that's funny. Can you guys tell I didn't sleep much last night? I'm working all day with kids. All right, here we go. Two Santas and an elf. Sounds like a start of a really bad joke. All right. <laughs> it's Santa. I know him. Can't move the tape off his face. Let's see if we can open him up. Aha. You got a raspberry lemonade lip scrub. Of a funny drink. <laughs> ra la ra blah, 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 blah. Raspberry lemonade lip scrub. <laughs> oh, that means we're going to do a giveaway. Look at that. Yes, I see. I see. As soon as I'm done showing this friend's boxes, we will do that. 
You're not Santa. You smell like beef and cheese. You sit on a throne of lies. <laughs> Love that movie. Tracy loves your earrings. <gasps> Thank you. Our new homeowner. Yes, Tracy, our new homeowner. Look at you. <gasps> oh, this one had two things in it. It just fell down. <laughs> so this one has our UFO, our unidentified fizzing objects. This is a bath fizzy that is lilac scented. And it had a piece of cake lip balm. Apparently, I was very obsessed with piece of cake lip balm. I put it everywhere. <laughs> so get back in there. <laughs> I'm going to fill Santa up. Close him up. And there's one of your Santas. Now let's do the elf. What is that? I burp like the soda scene. No, you don't. Oh, no, you don't. <laughs> I have never met somebody who can do that. That's ridiculously and funny. All right. Ooh, got another double. These are the mini fizzy racers. They're matchbox cars, but they're bath fizzies. Oh my gosh, Teresa. Wow. I don't burp like that. <laughs> Very rare. <laughs> Ask Lisa Ann. <laughs> it's okay. I believe you. All right, we have a couple bags left. Who are we going? Teresa Romano, number 10. Number 10. We good? Mm, I think so. Yep. I love these. I made a bow too, guys, and I stuck it in my head. Made my own bow. All right, Miss Teresa Romano. Oh, gosh. All right, Miss Teresa. Ho, ho, ho. Here we go. Mom, if it's too much, you don't have to keep getting up. Well, I do. You just put it on the table down the other end. We've got it written down. Who claimed each yeah, bag? It's okay. Raspberry Whimsy Soap Cupcake. Raspberry and black raspberry and vanilla scented with little tiny curls of soap in the background and little butterflies. Tabby, you didn't get it? Hmm. Let me try again. Hold on. I thought I sent it to you. You have the right address for it? Yeah, Tabby Proctor. Tabby Proctor. Hold on, Tabs. Oh, I took a picture of it. <laughs> you really want it? <laughs> there you go, Tabby. I'm sorry, love. I sent it, but it... it Blank. I just sent it, but it went blank. Do you need to take a picture again? No. For some reason, it's not letting me. You got it? Did it work? Because I just sent it, and then it went away. It wasn't there. See? Sent it. Oh, now it's there. You had to comment first, <laughs> I guess. I don't know. Tracy wants to know where we playing bingo. Yeah, we haven't started yet. Yeah, we haven't started yet, Trace. So, you one? there you go. Trace, last call. You want one? Mom will write you a ticket. Who's next? Oh, I'm sorry. Twelve. Adrian Watson. What else does Adrian have? Anything else? Yep. All right, what else? Uh, 23. 23. That's it. Nutcracker. <laughs> 12 and 23. So, Tracy, you want one or not? All right, Tabby. Good. I'm glad you got it, honey. I'm sorry. Clumsy thumbsy. That's me. All right. Woo! Look what you got. Somewhere over the rainbow soap cupcake. With a huge curl of rainbow in there. It is Japanese cherry blossom scented. Congrats. All right, Miss Tracy. Tracy, I'm going to text it to you, honey, because I have your local. So I'll get you. We friends off the screen. <laughs> All right, what's inside the nutcracker? Ooh, Midnight Dreams. This is a coconut, uh, uh, not coconut, cotton candy scented soap bar. I know it looks a little dark on camera, but it is a little brighter in person. It is pink and purple swirled together with white fluffy clouds. It is supposed to be like a galaxy almost, but it didn't quite out, come out that way. But it's okay. It's still good. Cotton candy soap. There you go. Number 23. All right, we'll send Tracy her thing. Why don't we finish the bags, and then you can send Tracy her okay. thing. Okay. All right, Tracy, I'm going to finish the bags, and then I will send you your thing. I was hoping to get a cutesy soap. Totally going to Instagram. 
go for it. Just tag me in it. Okay. My tag is the same as these are my tags. So Instagram at D U C K I E S S C or Facebook at D U C K I E S S C. Those are my tags. So tag me in the photo and I will definitely log on and give you a thumbs up. Okay. 16. Who had 16? Um, Cindy Cruz. Did she also have 22? No. No, that's Lisa Coffee, right? Yes. Okay. You can pull that with me. That way we can get this going. And then Galaxy was already shown. So on the shelf. All right. All right. Cindy Price. Oh, love your face too, Tabby. Yeah, I'm wearing my feathers today from y'all. Love them. So light. All right, number 16 for Cindy Price. You don't have a soap, but you have a bath fizzy. This is a cupcake bath fizzy. It is a three-in-one. It is a bath fizzy, a whipped soap, and a bar of soap, all in one. It is scented with sugar cookie. Congratulations. All right, and last but not least, Miss Lisa, number 22, came in and swiped up the last bag. Last bag is going to be... Ooh, bar of soap. Blue Lagoon. It's our mermaid soap. It is scented with jasmine fragrance oil. And it has a mermaid with a seahorse and a little crab friend that's all made out of soap and some seaweed. <laughs> Congratulations. Clean out your cookies. It might be lagging out your phone. Got kicked out again. Yeah, Candace, you might have to close down any other programs that you're running at the time. Um, or switch to a desktop or another device. Um, cause if you have your thing full of cookies, like, um, to, um, can't think today, like Teresa was saying, it might just close out of it. Or if your phone is due for an update, you might want to update it and come back. All right. We had 20 friends. Yes, we, did. we need to pick yes, we did. from the share drawing. Okay, Gonna wait for mom to hand me the bucket though. <laughs> You did. Okay. And I don't know, my friend. I'm sorry. I'm not very tech savvy when it comes to crashing and things getting kicked out. Um, all I can suggest is that you go out and come back in. I don't know. All right. So the games that we have been playing all week long. Look at that. Oh, my God. This bucket is huge. Okay. It's like the size of my face. And you guys almost filled it. I had to put tape over the handles because I needed more space. <laughs> you guys are amazing. Um, yeah, the best way to get tickets for this thing is to play on a Sunday. Sunday is our scavenger hunt. That's where you can get up to like 50, 60 tickets. And everyone who played on Sunday, with the exception of a couple of people, got the max amount of tickets, which was 60 tickets. Tickets. It's six zero, not 16, 60. And it's insane. So I put them all in here. I gave them a good mix. Mom's been mixing them all day. So I'm going to reach in. I'm going to grab one. Like I said, there's nothing in my hand. I'm just mixing. Oh, somebody fell out of the boat. Get them back here. I'm back. Did I drop another one? Yes, I did. Drop two. Get back in here. So purple, hang on. Okay. So here we go. Remember, you must be present to win, okay? This is for the share drawing for 20 friends being here. It was actually 21, but here we go. <laughs> I always do one for the amount of people that are here. So here we go. All right. I'm just going to dig deep. And that's the one it is. All right. <laughs> Lisa Coffee, are you here? Lisa Coffee, you must say here to get it uh, to count. Oh, my guests missed mine when went to the bathroom. Okay. Oh, yeah, Pat, you missed yours when you went to the bathroom. Mom can grab them, though. Mom's going to grab them. I want cherry pie body butter. Unfortunately, I do not have that in stock. Lisa Coffee, waiting for you, love. I know you're here. You just have to say it. <laughs> All right, I think there might be a lag. All right, Pat Massey, we're going to show you. Pat, you got the three boxes, so hold on. Put you over here, and I'll show you. Tracy, Sam's going to send you the bingo card. In I'm going to send it in a minute, Trey. Hold on. 
All right, let's see if she's here. Why don't you do packs while you're waiting to see if she's here, honey? Okay. I'll wait. I just put it off to the side. It's not, not in the bucket yet. All right, Pat. Here we go, babe. Sorry, I was on a roll and I was moving. I was showing everybody everything. So, hold on. So, Pat, your first one was a lip balm and a bath fizzy. Okay. I think that might be Lisa. I think she might have gotten kicked out. Maybe because she's traveling. Might be because she's traveling and the Wi-Fi might be bad. Hold on. That was Rosalie. I'm here watching even though I can't say anything to all you. Rosalie's here. Everybody say hi, Rosalie. <laughs> <laughs> Rosalie, if you want anything tonight, honey, just message me here. And as soon as I hear the bing, I'll take a look and you tell me what you want. Okay? We'll do it that way. All right. The second uh, Santa that you had, Pat, was a raspberry lemonade lip scrub. Okay. That was when it was in the second Santa. And in the elf that you picked, because you had three boxes, one of them being the elf, the elf that you picked had two fizzy racers in them, one red, one green. They're both lavender scented, and they are going to be available for purchasing tonight. But here's your box. Don't freak out that your box is huge, okay? I Everybody's, everybody's box is the same size to start. <laughs> and then I go down or up if I need to. All right, um, Lisa Coffee is not here, so I'm putting her name back in, and I'm going to pick again. All right, here we go. Dig, 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 dig. I'm thinking I'm going to take one right off the top this time. Ooh, pink. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter because I mix them up. Clayton Thomas. Oh, Thompson. Sorry, Clayton Thompson. Well, you're screwing up everything. I am. Here. I'm tired. <laughs> Clayton Thompson, are you here? Clayton Thompson. Yep, he's here. I don't see him on my screen I yet. See him. Well, it's great that you see him, but I have to see him. I see him. Here he is. All right. Clayton, you won a mystery gift that I'm not showing. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. I'll show you. Uh, it's right there. It, no. In the box. No, it's a box. And there's ornaments in it right in front of you. You. It's in the box that you just threw the box in. I'm going to come around that side and get you. <laughs> Sam, there's so much in this box. What do you I want? Know. That's the one I want. Thank you. All right, I put it in here. I forgot to put it at my table. I'm so sorry. Did I put it in here? I should have put it in here. Hold on, guys. All right, Clayton, I'm putting your name back in there. You want it. Mom's going to write you a new ticket. Okay. So I guess I'll have to put one together here for you. Hold on. I'm putting one together. Because I don't know what happened to the one I made that I put in here. All right. All right. Here we go. A bag of four mini soaps. You have two snowflakes, a penguin, and a teddy bear. <laughs> That's for Clayton. Okay, Miss Tracy, coming at you. I'm going to give this back to Mom. Remember, if you have been helping during the live, you will be put in a separate bucket. It is this one right here. This is the separate share bucket. So everybody who's been helping, your name is in this bucket. That will be pulled at the end of the night. You must be present to win for that one. Tracy, here's your bingo card because I am pulling five bingo numbers. Get those cards out. Get those cards out. I am pulling out bingo numbers. So Tracy. All right. Tracy, picture. Okay, Trace. It's on your, it's on your texting. It's on your texting number. And her number is. No, I'm kidding. I'm going to do that to you. <laughs> All right. I'm going to grab my cage here. All right, so all the numbers are in here, okay? Just want to show you guys. This is how I keep track of the numbers. I put them in the tray. All right. So here we go. Uh, if you're wearing earbuds, you might want to take out your earbuds because it gets a little loud. Honey, it's rough nifty with Teresa. That's Teresa Romano. Make enough for Ducky, you. please send extra business cards with my order. Would love to hand them out. Yeah, uh, how many you want? 
I literally have thousands. Thousands. Like I order them at like a 10,000 clip because they're cheaper that way. <laughs> so I have boxes and boxes of business cards downstairs. So how many do you want? <laughs> you have me singing the bingo song. <laughs> Here we go, guys. I'm going to mix them first and then I'll pick five. I always pick five at a clip. 10-ish or so. Okay, mom will write that down for me and I'll make sure I include it in your order. All right, here we go. One, two, three, four, and five. Okay, back to center. All right, so we got five numbers. Here we go. Whew, I gotta turn it, change my hands. All right. First number. Now, if you're gonna help with numbers, it's the first four that appear on my screen to help. And you must have all the numbers in your comment. O seventy. Oh, sorry. O seventy one. Jesus. Gosh, Louise, Sam. O seventy one. Shoot. Sorry. I'm not getting any harder on me. It's my name. I can't deal with it. I'm ducky. I'm ditzy ducky tonight. N forty one. N forty one. I apologize if it's blurry. I will try and read it correctly. <laughs> You're tiny. B eight. B eight. I, oh, I caught it. <laughs> I told you I'm clumsy today. I 23. I 23. And last one. I 16. I 16. First four on my screen, Adrian, Amy Mitchell. Anybody else wants to help? There's two spots available for help for tickets. All right, that's it. Deb Taylor and Clayton Thompson. Those are my four helpers. Thank you. Gotta be quick, guys. They're quick. <laughs> thank you. Thank you for your help, my friends. All right, so soap. That's what we're going with. We're still going. All right. I only showed one bar. <laughs> You're an hour and a half. And we're an hour and a half. <laughs> oh, my God. We're, it's going to be a long night, guys. All right. That's okay because Facebook, um, YouTube won't, won't kick me out. All right. Here we go. Number 27 is Tropical Paradise. It's one of the ones that we saw from the boxes before. It is a $5.75 plus tax soap bar. It is lilac scented. Each one is unique when I swirl them, okay, because they are all done by hand. No two are the same. There's the back. All the instruct, all the uh, ingredients are on the back. <laughs> we'll do that next, Deb, after we're done with doing soap. Soap was requested first. Um, so this is a goat's milk swirled uh, vegetable glycerin soap, lilac scented, number 27, if you would like it. It is three inches across, two and a half inches from side to side, and one inch thick cut. If you'd like this one, you're going to comment the number 27. And again, it is $5.75 each plus tax. It's one of the smaller bars of what I normally make. That's why it's a little less. <laughs> so if you'd like that one, you're going to comment 27. Put the number back on, on the shelf. All right, next one I'm going to show. Let's do the Christmas one, shall we? I'm just going to grab a random one. We'll do Christmas. All right, this is Oh Christmas Tree. This is pine, cinnamon, and sugar cookie scented. It is a goat's milk soap. It is also made with a little bit of vegetable soap. That's the darker colors here that you see. Okay. It features a Christmas tree that is a through and through design. Okay. No matter how much you use this bar, you will still have that tree picture on the soap. It is, has a little package present here. That's just a little piece of soap that I attached to it as well as this little duck guy here. It's a little on the three dimensional side, but not too much. Can I show the robot soap? No, I cannot because that is a custom order. I don't keep those in my normal inventory, but I can show you a picture of it on my phone. Sorry, Christy. Yeah, I don't keep those in uh, regular inventory because they are a special request item. Or if I'm going to, I know I'm going to an event where there's going to be a lot of kids. That's the only time I make those. So number 66 for this one. And it's called O oh Christmas Tree. It is $6.50 each plus tax. And it is three and a half inches tall. 
Deborah Taylor. To, okay, Deb, you got it. Just say the number. And two and a half inches from side to side, one inch thick cut. Number 66 for Deb Taylor, please. Mm -hmm. Anybody else would like it, please let me know. I'm just going to start putting them behind me on the counter, okay? Chair's a little creaky. Okay. Whew. Next one, number 194. Karen Sinawaski. Who's Karen Sinawaski? Not sure, but welcome. Hi, Karen. Sinawaski. Why does that sound familiar? I think she was here last month. Is that Scarlet? Scarlet? I think that's Karen. I think Karen is Scarlet. Just say yes, Karen, if I'm right. <laughs> I think I'm guessing you're. Yes. Yeah. Hey. Welcome back. Been a long time since I've seen you. Number 194 is our um, holiday cheer soap. It is raspberry, cranberry, orange scented. It is those red and white stripes. Okay. You would think it would be minty, but it's not. It's fruit. Um, it has a little bit of a sparkle to it, although the camera is not quite picking it up today. I don't know why, but it isn't. Um, it is three inches tall, two and a half inches across, one inch thick cut, and it is $6.50 each plus tax. If you'd like this one, Hi, Karen. Um, you're going to comment the number 194. Karen, if you would like to share this uh, video to any platform you personally own, you are more than welcome to tonight. Our word is jingle. J-I-N-G-L-E. Dawn Welch, 194 times two. Two of these. Okay. You got it. <laughs> I have two left. This one is two and done. I'm sorry, Oh, I see it. 194. It's these. Got it. <laughs> That's the one where I only had four bars left. I meant to tell you guys that. Sorry. So Dawn Welch has got two of them. I'm not going to make them give you up. I'm just showing. I have two left. Okay. If I only have a certain amount left, I have them over here on the side. All right. Um, thank you, Amy. We got you. This piece of hair is like touching my nose. <sighs> Set me off. I can't do it. So I don't like putting my bangs down, guys. All right. I guess I should have had nice. you wait to invoice me. <laughs> it's all right, Don. We'll get you. No worries. All right. Um, more soap. Soap, soap, soap. I only have two of these. Two. Two, two. And then they gone. It's the watermelon soap. It's going to be number 193. Watermelon. 193 is $6.50 each plus tax. It is a goat's. Oh, sorry. No, I'm sorry. It's a shea butter soap, okay? So it is vegan, and it also has some clear vegetable soap in it, as well as these little seeds. These little seeds are made with activated coconut charcoal soap. All right, so if you do have a coconut allergy, I do not recommend this, but it is an absolutely cucumber melon scented bar that is so beautiful. It's nice in the skin, makes your skin feel nice and clean, as all soaps should and do. So number 650. Uh, sorry, sorry, it's going to be 650 plus tax. It's number 193. Oh, my gosh. My brain. Ah, it's gone today. Can you show the... Yes, I can. I'll show that one next. So, this one is two and done. So, if you like this one, comment number 193. All right. I'll put it on the shelf behind me. Squeaky chair. <laughs> all right. It's going to be doing it all night. All right. Here we go. Because you're on the wood. Because I'm, yeah, I'm sitting on a wood chair with a wood floor. Yeah. All right. Where's my other one? Come back. Come back. <laughs> All right. So, as per request, here is our dinosaur soaps. And then I'll show you the minis. Because <laughs> I have dinosaur soaps in um, this, this kind of three dimensional bar. I have it in a flat bar. And then I've got them in minis. <laughs> so, we'll show you all the dinosaurs. No worries. Yeah, they stole my brain. And they ran off with it and they're eating bananas and. <laughs> all that fun stuff, right? All right, here we go. This is going to be number 50. Now, they all have the same number. They're just different shapes, okay? So I'm going to move the camera down so you can see what I'm seeing. Top of my computer. All right, these are called Dinosopias. Dinosopia. It's a mouthful, but it's cute. It's cute as heck. All right. It is number 50. Dinosopia comes in a T-Rex. Ah. <laughs> T-Rex. 
I'll show you guys a close up in a minute. T Rex, a Stegosaurus, and a long neck. They are all number five zero. Okay. They are all six dollars each plus tax. Okay. So here's a close up. This is T Rex 50. Carved by hand. All the details are done by hand. All right, so here's our T-Rex, and I think he's cute because he can sit <laughs> all on his own. Here's our Stegosaurus. Now, you guys may think that these are small. They, my hand is big, okay? These are not by any means small. They're a good hand, like you can have little hands grab onto them, and they're not going to go anywhere, you know? So it's not like a smooth-shaped bar. It's actually a little spiky or a little curved shape, so you can actually have little guys, you know, grab onto these with no problem. And it's fun, and you guys can get your little guys who don't like to wash their hands, you know, this is something fun for them to use or as a stocking stuffer, as a toy for a little while until you use it, you know. <laughs> um, and here's the long neck. He's got those stripes going down his back. He's got orange eyes. There's his tail. There's the other side of him. Okay. He's got big feet. There's the sticker. All right, so if anybody would like them, comment 50, and then the shape that you'd like, 50 uh, long neck, 50 steg, or 50 T-Rex. I won't make you spell out stegosaurus. That's a big word. <laughs> Christy already did. Christy, long neck and stegosaurus. Okay, um, anybody else? Anybody else? They're $6 each plus tax. Tabby wants all three. Tabby all three. Okay, mom's writing these down for me. Uh, oh, I'm sorry. I didn't tell you the scent. <laughs> they are total seduction scent, which is a mix of apples and florals. So it's a unisex scent. Okay. It is, goes for go boys or girls. I just want to read it to you. Hold on. It's a mix of musk, floral, apples, fresh citrus, and botanicals. Okay. Which means flower. It's a fancy word for flowers. Uh, <laughs> that's the scent. They're apples, florals, musk, and citrus. What's that? 15 sold. 15 items sold. That means we pick more bingo balls. Yay! <laughs> all right. So here we go. Christy wants the long neck and the stegosaurus. Tabby wants all three. Any other friends? No? Okay. That's fine. If you feel that after the show you want to add anything to your order, just give me the number and I will add it to your invoice. All right, here we go. Stay. Will you sit? Thank you. That T Rex does not want to sit today. Oh. It's the wrapping. It's the wrapping. Yeah, I know. He sits when he's on his own. All right. Bingo balls. Five more. Get those cards out. Let's go. You guys up so you're not staring up top of my camera. There we go. All right, here we go. And give it a little bit of a mix, and then they come out one, two, three, four, and last one, five. Ooh, we got a little bit of a snow going. Blue and white. <laughs> All right, here we go. Remember, if you get bingo, you have to tell me. I can't tell you if you get a bingo, okay? Because I can't see it, and mom won't tell me. First one, B15, B15. Next one, B11, B11. Next one, G49, G49. Next one, B4. B4. And last one. I'm trying to get it so you guys can see the number. G51. G51. All right. First four on my screen if you would like to help. Adrian Watson. Deborah Taylor. I'm looking to see who's helping. Christy Hubbard and Clayton Thompson. Sorry, Lauren, Clayton beat you. <laughs> yeah, 
Yeah, it was the first four on my screen. Hi, Serena. Serena, tonight's share word is jingle, if you'd like to share. All right. Dinosaurs. That's right. We're doing mini soap snacks. Oh, no. We're going to do the big ones, and then I'll put my gloves on, and I'll show you guys the smaller ones. Because the smaller ones are not wrapped. The reason why I don't wrap one set of the smaller ones is so that I can show you guys all the details because once it gets wrapped in the plastic it's a little hard to show you on camera all right so and with them being so small the details are very tiny so <laughs> I want to make sure you guys get the full fit <laughs> but that's why I put my gloves on how long am I going to be on till we're done <laughs> that's the best answer I could give you on average these lives go for about six hours I mean, no. <laughs> we try to get done in four. I try and get done in four. I really do try and get done in four. All right. This next one is called Back in Time. Back in Time comes in three different shapes. However, I only have two available currently right now. Um, but if you would like the T-Rex, you can totally go to my Facebook page and click on the uh, photo album that says Soaps. And it's right in there. So if you want to see what it looks like, you can check it out there. Um, I just didn't have time to make one before the live tonight. Been so busy making body butter. You guys have had me whipping and whipping all the time. <laughs> so this is back in time. The two I have to show you is the Stegosaurus and the Pterodactyl. They are number 51. <laughs> that is good. It's always good to prep. All right, they are $6.50 each plus tax, okay? They are scented with that um, blue, um, the same scent as Blue Skies, which is suit and tie, and that bergamot, gold, amber, and spice, okay? They are both goat's milk, all right? So one is a Stegosaurus, 51 Stegosaurus, and it is a three-dimensional bar. It does come off the bar a little bit, give you that little bit of detail. And then we have the... Pterodactyl, which is also a three-dimensional bar. It comes right off the top of the edge as well, but it is fused to the bar. It will not pop off, okay? So they are number 51. They are $6.50 each. Let me know if you'd like any of them. Christy Hubbard wants the Pterodactyl. Anybody else? I will make more of these if anybody else wants them. What number we got? 51. 51. Okay, so just Christy Hubbard Pterodactyl. You got it, love. Well, like I said, if anybody's watching this replay or wants to add to their invoice tonight, the number is 51. You can add to your invoice up until you receive your invoice. After you've received your invoice, you need to private message me yeah, add to add to your invoice, okay? All right, I'm going to put some gloves on. So that I have a sterile surface. All right, put down a sheet of plastic. And we're gonna show you my micro dinos. They're so cute. All right, I'm gonna tilt the camera down so that I'm not touching them with the clean gloves. All right, here we go. I feel like a doctor. <laughs> Take that off. All right, here we go. All right. Ready, here we go. All right. What's that? I'm talking to myself. Oh, okay. Trying to get everything done. <laughs> These are micro dinos. Micro dinos are made with vegetable soap. Okay. So they are vegan. They are scented with what is called fairy garden. Fairy garden is described as a fruity top note, wisteria, lilac, and it's considered a tangy floral, but not overly sweet by the um, company that makes that fragrance. Hi, Alexis. You are made it just in time for my micro dinos. <laughs> All right, here we go. So for micro dinos, they are a set of four for $2. One set of four is equal to one ounce of soap. So for one ounce of soap, it's $2 each plus tax, okay, per set. So in order to claim them, if you would like a T-Rex shape, you're going to say number one and the color. For a Tracerat uh, Stegosaurus, which is, no, straight, not, no, I said it right. For a Triceratops, you're going to say two and the color. And for a long neck, you're going to say three and the color. 
Okay? You'll see what I mean. So, for example, if you wanted a red T-Rex in your set, you're going to say one red. And then if you want multiples of these guys, you're going to put a time symbol, like an X, and then give me the number. All right? So here's one red. Let me see him there. And I'm going to show you all the T-Rexes first. One green. And they, they do stand. You can make them do a little conga line. <laughs> Here's the yellow. How do you pay? I do all of my invoicing for through Square. So what you do is you go to Facebook and you send me a private message with your email address. And I will send you your invoice that through your email. Once your invoice has been paid, here's the blue. So this would be one blue. I will ship out your item the next business day or your items um, the next business day. And I will send you a tracking number. One orange. So they pay I can do random sets. Yeah, I can do random. They pay by credit card. Debit yeah, card. you pay by credit or debit card. I do not accept checks. I do not accept cash because it takes too long to get here. And there's number one purple. Okay, so those are all the T-Rexes. Can you tilt the... I can't because my hands are clean. I'm sorry. What am I tilting? Just tilt it down. Here? Yep. Keep going. There you go, right there. Stop. Okay. So there are our one T-Rexes. Okay? So you leave us say one red, one green, one yellow, one blue, one orange, one purple. Okay? Those are the code for that one. All right. Four of these... Any four, you can mix and match if you want, but that four right there, that would be considered a set. That would be a $2 set right there, okay? And that is one ounce of soap. All right, so now let me show you the twos. The twos are the triceratopses. If you would like a random set, you can just say random set, and I will make a random set for you, okay? Just don't get mad if I <laughs> do a random set and you don't like what's in there. Um, this is number two, yellow. Ooh, taking a header. This is two, green. Triceratops. This is two, red. Now, these do come wrapped when you get them. This is just the naked set. Because <laughs> they're not covered or anything. Yeah, these are all little mini dinos. These are called my micro dinos. This is number two blue. Two blue. And then we've got purple too. So two purple. It's like that electric purple. And I think I'm missing, yeah, I'm missing the orange. So where's the orange? There he is. Orange number two. Yep, so four of these together would be a set. Now, you can mix and match. You can get T-Rexes, Triceratopses, and long necks all together in one bag, or you can get all the same of uh, the same color. It's up to you. It's completely customizable, okay? You just got to tell me the number, the shape. Just tell me the number, because I'll know what shape it is. So either one, two, or three, and then tell me the color. All right, there we go. Those are our Triceratopses. And now for the long necks. These guys are so derpy looking, but they're so cute. <laughs> Uh, because it's got a big old head and small neck, <laughs> big body. All right, here's number one. Oh, you can see his little polka dots on there. That way, if I tilt it, there's number three, yellow. Yep, two dollars for four of them plus tax. There's a little bit of tax on the end because I am in Connecticut and I do have to charge for tax. Green, number three. Do you have a shipping fee? Yes, I do. It depends upon the size of your order and what box it fits into. If it fits into a small flat rate mailer, which I can't grab right now because my hands are covered in gloves, but I will show you later. Uh, here's number three blue. That would be $8.30. That's for items that are slim, not bulky, um, that can easily be put, put into that mailer. The next size up is $15.05. This is number three purple. I know it looks similar to the blue, but it is purple. Okay, there we go. We can do a little conga line. 
Um, and then the next size up from the 15 would be the $21.10 box, and that's very rare to use those. All right, here's the red three. Okay. And here's the orange three. All right. And those are all my micro dinos. Now, if you want a random set, you just say random set, and I'll put one together for you. Like Karen. My like Karen just did. Karen, you want a random set? You got it, babe. I will do it for you. All right. You're not going to get these because they're not wrapped, okay? But I do have them off on the set. I'll make one for you right now, okay? Anybody else for a set? Take these gloves off. Then you can show the shipping boxes. And I can show the shipping boxes. And if they're smaller than the 850, you try and do that too. Like the Micro Dino set easily fits in one of these, okay? You would not get anything bigger than this. <laughs> it's, smaller. it's huge, all right? Compared to the micro dinos, this is huge. All right, so this is the eight dollar thirty cent mailer. Here's the fifteen dollar mailer, okay. And then here's the big one. Boy. All right, let me grab my baggies and my. Oh my okay. god! Hold Chris, on, Christy. I know, I see it. Hold on. So she needs to. Oh All no, right. no, I got it. I got it. I got what she's talking about. I got it. Gotcha. I got you. Because look at this. This is what I use at my shows. Let me show you guys. I have these little boxes at my shows. Oh, can you do something with that? So it's sitting on the table. I'm not going to knock it over. I have this little compartment guy with all the different ones inside. And I have them set up as a rainbow. All right, so Karen wants a random set, so I'm going to grab a bag for her. Now, there's the label. I do not stick the label to the dinosaurs, okay, because the label is, like, two times bigger than the dinosaur <laughs> in some cases. So, random set, okay. One, two, just randomly going around picking stuff out. Three, All right, Karen, I got you. So if you could write stickers for me. Yes, I would. Karen, it's Christy Hubbard. Okay. So Christy Hubbard wants a number one red. That's a T-Rex red. A number two blue. So number two and blue. That's the Triceratops. A number one long neck green. No. Two blue, one green. That's the T-Rex. Green T-Rex. And a number two yellow. That's the Triceratops yellow. Okay. So this is Christy Hubbard. Christy Hubbard, just to confirm. You wanted a green T-Rex, a red T-Rex, a blue Triceratops, and a yellow Triceratops. Give me a thumbs up or a yes for Christy Hubbard. No, Alex. Alexis, you got it, Christy. So this is you. Alexis, don't ever apologize for asking questions. I encourage questions. There's nothing wrong with asking questions. I actually love questions. So ask away. Do I have a website? No. I have Facebook, Instagram, and I have my email address. I do not have a website. It was not cost effective for me at the beginning of this year. And to start one this late in the year was not not avail not feasible with me doing all the work and everything that I have to do to get it. It's, it's just, just Facebook. Shows if you want to look it up on Facebook, that's the handle to get you the quick link. That is the quick link. Okay. Right there at D U C K I E S S C. That will take you right to it. If you type it in the search bar. All right. These micro dinos would be great for the, yes. yeah, Absolutely. I actually recommend that you put them in a little dish by themselves. I think that's <laughs> Rosalie. Yep. Rosalie. I did share your video two times. Okay, Rosalie, no Better. worries. We got you, babe. I only give credit for the one, but thank you for sharing twice. <laughs> um, yeah, these are great for stocking stuffers, and I do recommend that you get, like, a small little dish, like, from the Dollar Tree, or if you have a random dish in your house. And you can put them in the dish for, like, little guest soaps or, if, like, your little guys in the house, you know? Um, so, yeah. But, yeah, I have a whole, whole bag, all different ones, <laughs> and a whole box. So if anybody needs them, let me know.
All right, just use that code system that we use to get the ones that you want. So number ones are T-Rexes, number twos are Triceratops, and long necks are number threes. And then you just give me the color. And the color is anything in the rainbow. Yeah, my inventory changes like almost every month and it's ridiculous on what they want to charge me for me to update it every month. So it's just easier for me right now to go through Facebook and uh, Instagram at the time. And like I said, if you think you might, if you want something and it, maybe it's off season or you don't think I have it in stock, ask. Chances are I probably still have it. Okay. All right. So those are all my dinosaurs. Those are the three dimensional ones, the flat 2D ones and the mini ones. <laughs> okay. Um, do we want to do more soap or do we want to jump into body butter real quick? Take a break. Because we can take a break from soap. I have no problem with that. Only got $30 and until December. I got to choose carefully. <laughs> yeah, no problem. Not I a problem. That. Yeah, the last day for me to be able to ship for those of you who just popped in is December 10th. Okay. After December 10th, I cannot guarantee with the post office the way it is that it will get there before Christmas or by Christmas at that point. I know. Oh, I can't wait, Teresa. And you're in New York, aren't you? You're in New York, right? Hold on. What's up? What's Amy Mitchell? Up yes, to you. Random set. Pat Massey, random set. Okay. And why, why is Amy Mitchell saying yes, please? I don't know. <laughs> that I don't know. Amy, what are you talking about, babe? Oh, you are in Connecticut. Girl, you need to come see me. I always post my events on my events tab in my Facebook page. So whether I'm attending an event, hosting an event, this is hosting, okay? Me and you guys live like this, that's hosting. Um, when I attend an event, it says on my event page that I'm hosting it, but I'm not hosting it. It will be like Ducky Soapy Creations goes to, you know, and then what I'm going to, all right? Um, I generally, because of Schmovid this year, you know, Schmovid, um, I haven't done shows other than the one in my front yard that Amy Mitchell came and visited me, um, and a couple other friends visited me. Um, oh, and, and watch out, because if it warms up, you might do another one. If it warms up in December, I'm, uh... Or January, even. Or January. You know, I mean, one Christmas we were wearing shorts. Um, I, I could go live from my front yard again. That would be fun. Oh, yes. Amy wants to see Body Butter next. That's what body Butter. You got it. About. Okay. I know. Everybody loves the Body Butter. Okay. Random set, Pat Massey. Here you go. Pat Massey. Okay. And, yes, 2021 cannot come fast enough. Yeah. Oh, tell me about it. And yes, I had to no cancel. Tomorrow. I had to cancel 30 events and back out of four events of the 30 because of Schmovid. Oh, so angry. You don't understand how angry I was. Because friends were like, I'm going to come see you. I'm going to come see you. And then I said, event got canceled. And they went, no. And I was like, I know. <laughs> but they still came and got their stuff anyway. So it's okay. Snow. Yeah, Amy, I know. We're going to get snow tomorrow. I love snow. We're not getting enough. We're not getting enough, though, at the coast here. We're not going to get it. Um. All right. Oh, I'm losing my watch. Came undone. That's okay. Take it off. Uh, De-blinging as the show goes on. Uh, <laughs> Just make sure that Chloe gets take one. Uh, oh! Hey, it's not that kind of show. No, it's not. <laughs> <laughs> All right. What happened to you? I lost your face. You lost my face? Yeah. You, Hello? You went black. What happened? Show me. You got kicked out, too. Okay, what do I do? Go out and come back in. <sighs> take your finger. Yes. Poke it on the black. No. Give me your thing. Unplug.